traffic and construction are expected to make travel around Madison's west side even more complicated as tens of thousands of fans come in for the American Family Golf Tournament. So emergency officials, firefighters, they're trying to make sure they have access to University Ridge this weekend as well. That's where Eden Chuckle is this morning with the latest efforts to keep the golf fans safe. Good morning, Eden. Hi, Adam and Danica. Good morning. I got to say that my view here at University Ridge Golf Course is pretty nice this morning. And this is where the second American Family Tournament is going to be held. Last year, they had about 56,000 people attend. This year, they are expecting an even larger crowd. And as you can imagine, with so many people in one place, organizers want to make sure that they can keep everyone safe just in case things go wrong. Now, the Madison Fire Department is going to be here to respond to any emergencies. UW Health will also have first aid stations next to the second tee and the 14th green. Last year, there were no major medical issues reported. There were some fans who dealt with a sprained ankle and a bee sting, but organizers say that they're also keeping an eye on the weather because they do want to make sure that people out here are safe. They say that they can't control severe weather, but they have a plan if it occurs. Mother Nature controls that, so uh, we continually watch it. We have weather officials here on site uh, 24 hours a day, all week long, and uh, we'll ensure the safety of all of our players and our fans that if weather's approaching, we'll uh, clear the course. Uh, at the same token, we, we'll be here to, to manage that aspect. It's just the one element we don't control, uh, but we're prepared uh, for all elements. So organizers say that they want fans to be able to engage with the players, and that's how the structure of this tournament is set up. Bleachers are built close to the tee boxes, but security is going to be there to make sure that fans are being respectful to the players. Gates are going to open this morning at 10. Uh, the Wisconsin Chamber Orchestra is also going to put on a concert on the course at 7 tonight. It should be busy on Highway PD, so set aside some extra time to get here. Uh, organizers also say that carpooling might be a better option. Back to you. Yeah, they've got a couple of different parking lots mm -hmm. you can park in and then get bust in if you're going because mm -hmm. there will be traffic there. Eden Chuckle reporting live from University Ridge. Great assignment for her this morning. <laughs> Thanks, Eden.